With the introduction of the latest version of Analysis Suite Software version 3.1, we now have a new workflow for rare allele detection to more objectively adjust the calling of data points on your scatter plot. First, assign tasks to your chips with the designation of Rare Unknown, Wild Type, or No Template Control in the Define Chips tab. Next, in the Review Data tab, go to the Settings menu depicted by the gear icon along the top of the scatter plot. Notice the new Global Settings slider bar at the bottom of the dialog window. This threshold represents the probability that a given point is part of the non-amplification or wild-type clusters. The values on the threshold are logarithmic values due to the fact that the density of the non-amplification and wild-type clusters are much greater than the density of the clusters associated with the rare target. For example, if a value of minus 100 is selected on the bar, this corresponds to a value of e to the minus 100. Review your chips and assign a value that provides the best objective automatic calling of all your chips. Due to the nature of the function, you can think of the slider bar as going from more stringent, you'll get less rare positive points, to less stringent, you'll get more rare positive points. After you set the global setting, if you desire, review each chip and adjust the calls as necessary using the lasso tool or the threshold in crosshairs. Then, if you have replicates, you may want to overlay them to check the calls and fine-tune as necessary. Thank you for taking the time to watch this tutorial. Please watch the other Analysis Suite video tutorials for more tips on how to use the software.